Hey guys, this is KG48, and welcome back to my Ark Survival Evolved Let's Play. This is Season 1, Episode 12, and um, yeah, I finally made it home uh, with my dinosaurs intact. Um, everything came out okay, and uh, I'm going to spend some points now. Now, I've been reading on the... F on, I don't remember where I read it. I read it somewhere that you can actually get quite a bit of points by just making the, the, ha the hat over and over and over. So we're going to try that today. Now, the hat's a little bit of a waste. I'm trying not to go too much with clothes. Uh, I did do some research on this game, and single player works exactly the same as multiplayer. You get the same amount of points, uh, the same amount of time, everything's normal. And I kind of find that wrong. Um, I think the developers have talked about it, although I haven't seen it myself. But um, I think they're, they realize if they want single player to be a thing, you need to give us Engram points at a faster clip and... We need more of them because you can't learn everything. Uh, so that's kind of a problem. But we are going to make some hats to get some cheap experience here. So where do we want to put our points now? Let's put some points in... Let's go with stamina again. And we're going to learn the hat. And we still have 14 points left over. Let's see what we got here. First of all, let's see what level we are. Yep, we're almost level 10. I think I'm going to save my points. Again, I'm going to save my points because there's going to be certain things I'm really going to want uh, down the line. And there's nothing I absolutely need right now, to be honest. Although, I am going to need the Mortar and Pestle and the Narcotic Consumes. I believe you need the Mortar and Pestle. can only be crafted out of Mortar and Pestle. Yeah, so we need the Mortar and Pestle. And then we'll get this as well. We know we need these two. Um, that's going to allow us to make uh, poison tip arrows that will help us uh, trank dinosaurs a lot easier. Alright, so with that being done, let's go right here and take a look at the hat. And the reason the hat is so nice is because it only takes uh, 10 fiber. So it's really sweet. So let's go ahead and grab some fiber. We have lots of fiber from uh, harvesting berries. So let's just, let's just grab all the fiber we have. Well, maybe not all. What do you guys got? First of all, let's check our dinosaurs make sure they're not starving. Uh, another thing I need to remember to do is hit F to get into my dinosaurs. So, uh, yeah, you've got a lot of fiber on you. Let's just take all the fiber off so we know where it is. And then we'll make some decisions after that. Um, this guy leveled up as well, so... Man, it's got a lot of fiber, dude. My goodness. So I'm not sure what to give this big guy. Um, he's pretty strong on health. Stamina and oxygen are fine. Food is not a problem. Uh, he's got he can carry a lot of stuff. I'm thinking melee damage is probably his weak point. So let's give him some more melee damage. All right, so he's level five. Okay, looking good, looking good. He's got some meat on him. We'll keep the meat on him for now. And let's take a look at our other guy, our little Dilo here. Oh no, you know what? From now on, if I go into him by holding down E, I'm gonna move out and press F. That's the only way I'm gonna learn to remember. Okay, he's fine. He also leveled. Um, honestly, I just want this guy to stay alive. I think I might go with health. Uh, his weight's not going to be good no matter what. His melee damage is already pretty good. Let's go with health. Try and get him some more health so he can he can live longer. Alright, so we've got all of the fiber we're going to need on us. So let's put a little bit of fiber in here. How about 300? And then we'll just use the rest on, uh, on hats. I don't know. Why not? Uh, all right, let's see what we got here. So what else did we uh, learn? Mortar and Pestle takes Stone and Hide. And the Narco thingies take... I think you make those in the, in the Mortar and Pestle, and I've never made them yet. So we're going to hold off. I'm worrying about that right now. So let's go ahead and make this hat and see how good the experience is. How about eight? Let's make eight hats. Let's take a look. 40, uh, 42.9. Uh, 40, 423.9. Yeah, you get one point for every hat. You know what? That's not great. Maybe you're supposed to be doing that earlier, at an earlier level. Maybe it's something good to get you from like 5 to 9, 5 to 10, but I don't see that as being that good, to be honest. Although, what else am I going to do with the fiber, right? Might as well just use it. So, alright. So, with that being with that being done, let's get in here. And let's see what else we got in here. Alright, we got some wood there. Honestly, I don't remember what we have in here. That's why I'm looking. Let's, uh... Yeah, th these chests are all full. Not awful. They're all full. <laughs> um, okay, well, you know what? It looks like we're gonna have to make some more chests. So let's go ahead and... Alright, all those things are done. And, yeah, we barely... Wow. Did I really craft eight of them? Nope, first let's put one on.
Um, okay. Did I make clothes before? I'm pretty sure I did. All right. Well, I'm going to, I'm going to let you know what happened uh, on the way back here. I didn't mention it because, you know, you didn't see it and it, it wasn't really a big deal. Uh, well, it was kind of a big deal, but you know, uh, I didn't mention it. Um, when I was bringing the, the dinosaurs back here, I actually died and I had to go back and get them. I got jumped by raptors a couple times and I had to go back and get the dinosaurs. Uh, yeah, that's right. I never found my body. That's why I don't have any clothes. Okay, fair enough. Fair enough. Well, let's go ahead and make some clothes because, you know, we could always use them. Yeah, I, I didn't want to tell you because I was worried that, you know, you guys would be upset that you missed it. But I'm going to tell you right now, um, it was it was like five seconds of excitement and it was like... 20 minutes to a 40, 40 minutes of me trying to find my body again. All in all, you didn't miss anything. That's what I'm trying to say. Alright, put that on. Put that on. I'm not sure what I can do with these hats. To be honest. I don't know if I can do anything with them. Probably, you know what? We, you guys need some light, don't you? Alright, I'm crafting up a torch. Did I learn standing torches? That's another thing I have to learn. See, that's what I'm talking about. There, you don't get enough points. You simply do not get enough points, and that's that's a problem, especially for me doing a let's play. I did figure out some ways to cheat in um, Ingram's skills or points and stuff. Uh, there's a couple different ways to do it. Um, I'm not going to get into it now, but some people said that uh, said that like when you do it, it could be buggy, and you know I've heard a bunch of things about it. I'm going to try not to cheat him in, but I'm telling you right now, guys, I mean, it's being on single player, you know, you would have other people to help you out. Uh, you would have, you'd have other people to help you out with this. The game was balanced around multiplayer, and the fact that I can't use these items is kind of, uh, it's kind of irritating, so I might eventually uh, cheat them in. I don't even look at it as cheating, because to be honest, I think I should have them anyway. Alright, thatch. We need thatch. Thatch. You know what would be cool if we had, like, NPCs that we could, we could like, level up? You know, not dinosaurs. I mean, like, NPCs that we could level up to uh, possibly learn some skills and have them make stuff for us. Let's eat some more berries. And let's see if this guy's got any thatch on him. Got any thatch, bro? I'm gonna need that leather. I'm gonna need the stones. And I don't see any thatch. Oh, he leveled again? Damn. Alright. More melee damage. Can I move? Yes, I can. Alright. Thatch. I, all I see is a lot of berries. Yeah. He doesn't have any thatch. And the other guy doesn't have any thatch either. Alright, let's go get some thatch. Alright, take it easy, bro. It's gonna be okay. I promise. Another problem with multiplayer is actually, you know, I can't I can really move now. Let me go throw some stuff in the chest. Another problem with multi uh, single player is, uh, is um, you know, your server's not running a lot, so the trees don't really grow back um, as much. And you know, I'm okay with that. That's fine. I understand why it's like that. It's just a little something. Uh, although the fact that you know I don't have enough points for my skills does bother me. Um, you know, when I'm playing with like Engram, uh, I mean, when I'm playing with Andam and stuff. Uh, you know, we have, like, each other to lean on, and, you know, Games for Kicks can learn some stuff, and, and it works, but when you're by yourself, it's just it's just pretty screwed up. But, I want to play some single player, so, and for those of you who don't know, uh, I did have some people asking me why I keep restarting the world. Um, multiplayer is pretty bugged at the moment, and when I log on to, like, do a Let's Play, I can't be having multiplayer be all screwed up. Uh, it, it cuts into my time, I don't have a ton of time to record, and I need stuff to work. Now, I'm going to continue, I'm actually going to continue to do a multiplayer, um, Andam, uh, Games for Kicks and I are going to, uh, do, c continue doing the Let's Play, for them it's going to be the same Let's Play, for me I'm going to start a new series, uh, from multiplayer. I've gone through and re, I've gone, I've gone through and changed the name of all these videos, and this will now be known as a single player Let's Play for the whole time, and, uh, you know, with some friends in from, you know, before for a few videos but for the rest of the series it's going to be single player and then i'm going to start a new a new series for multiplayer they also took the gamma um the gamma thing out of the game by the way i can't turn gamma up so unless someone's figured out a way around that that i don't know of but as far as i know you can't you can't turn it up anymore all right we need more thatch here thatchy 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 there we go. Alright, let's go and make another chest. 
and that's going to come in handy. The chest, these first chests are really kind of crappy, but I'm kind of okay with that. You know, I don't mind the first chest being crappy. It gives you something to work towards later on. So, that's fine. I uh, don't want to put it over there. We should probably build walls. I don't want to put chests down before walls. If you put chests down before walls, then you run the risk of the of the walls not, not fitting. And then once you put down the chest, you don't want to knock the chest back up. So we do the wall first. It's just easier. Eight. Okay, and then we put down some chests. I'd like to put one in the corner, but even that's a little risky. No, you know what? I'm going to make another wall first. I need to make these walls anyway. I might as well make them first. Man, we really need a lot of thatch. I've really deforested this area, by the way. My goodness. There used to be so many trees around here. Sorry about the darkness, guys. Like I said, I can't... I can't do nothing about it. There we go. We got our last wall. Well, not our last wall, but the last wall for the time being. And then I gotta get that mortar and pestle going. I gotta start doing stuff with those narco berries. Um, I've never messed around with the narco berries before uh, with the mortar and pestle. But, you know. There's a lot of things I want to do. I also want to go for some airdrops. Uh, I did see some white beams of light that I might be able to get. For airdrops. I got a lot of things I want to do. A lot of things I want to do. I'd like to find a pet. My friend got a, a Velociraptor. And he basically built right where Velociraptors were walking through. And he and like there was one that was walking through. And he kept spawning. And like punching him out. Although he said he kept spawning. But I don't know how he kept spawning. Because your bet is a 10 minute spawn timer. He must have knew the area. And like ran back. Before it was like. You know before the Velociraptors are gone. That's, what, that's the only thing I can think of. Okay. Seven. Yeah, let's put them right here. Come on. There you go. Alright, let's just keep all our fiber in this chest. Fiber doesn't weigh that much, so we can't, we don't want to keep it all in here. It's a waste. Uh, as far as chest work, you can only have up to 12 items of any, like, of different kinds in a chest or... 50 weight, whichever comes first. So, put some other stuff in there as well. Actually, we're going to need that. Possibly. Let's go ahead and make our mortar and pestle. Now we're going to need 65 stone. That's a lot of stone. I don't think I have 65 stone. That's all wood. Uh, stone. Oh god, yes, I have 65 stone. Never mind. It seems that wood weighs more than stone. I'm guessing those stones are supposed to be like rocks. You know, like pebbles or something. Maybe not pebbles, but not like, you know, stones is the way we think of stones. Okay, so there we go. Not sure I want to put this. Um, let's put it at the foot of our bed. I've never dealt with this before. So let's see what we got here. Um, drugs, consumable, there we go. And what do we need for this? We need the narco berries, I think. Yep, right there, narco berries and spoiled meat. That's why you need to save the spoiled meat for your information. Um, okay, narco berries and spoiled meat. It's funny, I'm gonna have a hard time finding enough spoiled meat for this. Okay, yeah. It would make sense, all my meat's all my guys. Uh, narco berries and meat. You know, maybe we should cook some of this meat as well. Yeah, we definitely should. Uh, seven. Yeah, let's cook seven pieces up. And let's make sure our Dilo has plenty of meat before we go throwing meat away. Um, yeah, he's still got a lot of meat. Oh, it is spoiling on him, but I wanted some of it to spoil at a faster rate. So what we'll do is we will... Yeah, that might even be more meat than he needs. Yeah, eight meat should be okay with him. We'll go, we'll go hunting for meat in the morning, for sure. For sure. So with meat on me, don't forget meat spoils quicker. 
on people than on dinosaurs, so now that meat's gonna uh, spoil a lot quicker. So we'll just put that in here. No, we won't. <laughs> can we put it in here? Yes, we can. All right, then we're gonna put some... Uh, what do we need? Five narco berries per one of these, so... I guess we could just put all the narco berries in there. Oh, narco berries spoil slower on dinosaurs. So you don't want to put more than you need to in there. Um, what did I just do? Wait, where did all my narco berries go? I dropped them, didn't I? There we go. Alright. Three, four, three, four, five. There you go. Okay, so how do I do this? I just put this stuff in here? Where'd it go? I don't see it. Oh, there it is. Yeah, this is a little, this is a bit of a weird in interface. Drugs, berries, meat, okay. Yeah, it's a bit of a weird interface. Go ahead and craft that. Now this stuff I was told is not as strong as um, the narco berries, but it doesn't go bad. So, you know, that's pretty cool. Plus you can use it for uh, bows and arrows to put poison on the tip of your arrows. So, all right, let's put the rest of the narco berries back on the dinosaur so it doesn't go bad. There you go. And is it almost daytime? It looks like it's almost daytime, so. How are you doing, buddy? Yeah, you're doing good. You got plenty of meat. You're good. You're good. I'm deciding if I want to take these dinosaurs with me. I probably will, because I honestly, I need meat. Really? I mean, really what I need is meat, so. And I would like to get a, a Velociraptor and maybe some tougher dinosaurs. The problem is I'm going to I'm gonna want a bow and arrow for that. And those uh, narco thingies. And I did level, so let's see what we want here. Um, you know, movement speed probably wouldn't be too bad. Um, uh, yeah, let's go with some movement speed, why not? Alright, level 10. Big level, we can make a lot of stuff here. Alright, so I really like these irrigation pipes, but the fact of the matter is, I don't absolutely need them. So, I'm going to leave it alone for now. Uh, Parasaur saddle, I don't think I'm going to catch a Parasaur anytime soon. Um, what else do we got? We got wood stuff for the wood house. As much as I want to make a wood house, guys, I can't really justify spending that stuff. I need level 15 for the bow, for sure. It looks like level 15 is the last time something opens up. Or is the next time something opens up. So I got five levels. So I'm not really sure what I want to get here. I don't know what the cooking pot does. That's I'm, You know what? I should get standing torches for let's play purposes. Alright, let's go through this and look. Okay. Do we need a spear? Probably don't need a spear. Uh, we definitely don't want paper. I've got these building materials for a reason I want to build. I could get the thatch roof. We'll see. Don't need a sign. Don't need f any of this stuff. I mean, I could use a water skin. Um, oh, that's a good saddle. A Fiomia saddle. I can get one of those. And that's, that's a mounted um, dinosaur. Although I think it's pretty slow. So I'm not going to get that just yet. I'm going to do some research on that dinosaur. I think he's pretty slow. So it might not be worth getting. Honestly, I don't mind getting the dinosaur. It's just I don't know if I want to waste um, six points on the saddle. Uh, gunpowder. I don't know what shark powder is, so I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna bother with that. Honestly, I don't really know what a lot of this, flare gun, I don't need, spyglass, who cares, paintbrush, no. Crops, eh, maybe. Not really concerned about that right now, we need wood things. Okay, so these aren't, uh, these aren't that big, this is, big. I'm gonna get the standing torches for let's play purposes. And... I'd like to get the wood building. Or I really need this water skin, though. Honestly, I really need the water skin, and that's all my points. Damn it. But I really want wood... I really want wo a wood building as well. The thing is, I don't need a wood building. A wood building would only be for me to, um... Just feel cooler in a wood building. It's not really needed. <sighs> yeah, the water skin's important. Damn it. Water skin, standing torches. See what I mean with these points? They're just... It's just not enough. It's simply not enough. And they don't come fast enough either. 
Alright, let's go ahead and make ourselves a water skin. The water skin is nice. Uh, the water skin basically lets you bring water with you, although it does start leaking. So, like, you want to take it, like, you know, when you're about three quarters of the way down. I think the, I think I was told the water skin um, loses water at the same pace that you do. So, once you get down around half thirst, you should probably use it. I mean, for whatever that's worth. All right, there. Let's get rid of that. Get rid of that. You're fine. We should probably make another slingshot. Oops. There we go. And this was this was a spot for the spear, but I'm gonna leave it blank right now because that might be for something else. Some nah, I shouldn't leave it blank. That's stupid. Just move your stuff over. There we go. Leaves more room for stuff. Okay. All right. So let's make sure we've got everything off us. We can we can get uh, hide. That can go, you can go, you can go. See, this thing isn't anywhere near full now because it's wasting space. I hate that. Um, this thing's not even full. We've got a lot of different items. Oh, I know how we can, I know how we can fix this. Grab some of the wood out of here. Then put this stuff in there. And then put the wood in here. Perfect. The thing is, though, it makes it hard to store stuff in a convenient fashion. Because, you know, I want a chest of all one thing. And then a chest of all one another thing, you know? I don't like chests with a bunch of different things in them, but... I guess you really don't have a choice. Let's see how overburdened this guy is. If he's not too overburdened, we will go. Nope, he is just fine. He is just fine. Um, okay, so we're, co we're kind of coming up to the end of the video. So I'm going to call this one here. That's going to be it for episode 12. And we'll see you next time for episode 13. Till then, take it easy.